Alright, yeah, and welcome back to some more RimWorld Beta 18 with the Medieval Times mod, and today we're gonna make some progress. What are we actually doing? I don't quite know. Um, <laughs> but damn it, if we are gonna make some progress. So, Ape is currently working on extending out the dining hall. I wanna delete this wall, move these up here, and then have some, like, um, sets of armor, essentially, going along the top end here, just kind of a, as a decoration thing. Ugh, what's going on here? Severe illness. Huh. That seems very minor for a severe illness. But you know- Oh, did you like have a beer or something? Or did you try? I have no idea. Either way, uh, Stepan, go and rescue mate, please. I don't think anyone else is uh, struggling with that kind of thing. We do have some infections. Which, you're a little behind on that one, but it's it's manageable, at the very least. We're going to make some progress today, even if it kills a colonist. Which, at this rate, maybe it will. Stepan, did you just leave without tending to mate? Yeah, it looks like a colonist is going to die today. Great. Alright, let me just check everyone else's health, because this is kind of ridiculous. We got a lot of stabs and things like that we don't really want. Nobody wants stabs, right? Uh, it looks like everyone's tended to. You're ahead, Landoa, but I want you to still rest because I don't want you to die. That would suck. And you're 2% ahead. Okay. Seems legit. Uh, do I even want this? Oh, no, never mind. I was going to say, do I want this to continue? Uh, but it's not already, so that's completely fine. So as far as... I haven't extended these out. Silly me. And we're cut off, so lift that up. Uh, as far as slate is concerned, we only have 82. Should be fine, I think. Is that our husky that's pregnant? Looks like it. Our husky that's hanging around outside. Sure, why not? Still loads of major breaks. Eat your weak stew, you fool. Get on with it. We've got quite a lot of food, actually, which is very good. Val is unhappily nude. What are you missing? Pants, by the looks of things. We seriously not got any pants? Huh. Alright, well, let's get a bill for... Huh, suspended trousers is already uh, on the docket, it seems. We have a freeze, which means either a raid... Yep. They're attacking immediately. It's a big group of people. Alright, as for this raid... Oh boy, we haven't even got our uh, defenses up. Okay, uh, I'm going to draft everyone up. I'm going to get them out here. And I'm going to get them working on resetting some of these deadfall traps. Because we got a few injured people, so I'm actually going to need the assistance of our colonists here to make sure... I'm going to go to one time speed and then rearm. Ah, ape. Undraft. Rearm. Get on with it, Landoa. Nope. Rearm. Rexios is already on one. Trobo. Keep going. Kanto. Keep going. I think we've got time. Oh, maybe not. Well, luckily for us, I think they're mostly melee units. Yeah, so timing's not going to matter too much here. Although, what I will say is anyone who's not currently working on anything should go and do their thing. You need a weapon. Go and get the bandit's hammer, I think. 80. Actually, we got some superior things in here. 77, 76, 65, 98. There you go. Go grab that. Here they come. Come on, guys. I think it's too late now. Kanto, get inside. Uh, mate, get inside. Val, I want you to block the door. Trubbo, I want you standing there. Delilah, I want you grabbing this arming sword. Kai, I want you blocking the door. Why won't you? Oh, I'm not drafting you. That would explain a lot. Uh, Zeke, head on up here. Beautiful. Alright. 
Uh, Brexios, it's not time for dinner right now. I think that's everyone moved. Let the traps do their thing. And I want Ape, I want you moving up here to come and back up any of the guys who go down. Mate's shooting's a bit terrible, so I kind of want to give him a melee weapon. Did someone just go down? No, we're all good. Uh oh. My animals seem to be getting murdered. Go get that bow. Yep. Well, at least it's drawing them away. I don't think. Yeah, there's nothing else I have to worry about. Come on, Val. Stay up. You can do it. Ouch. Uh, Landoa, block the way. There we go, he's down. No, 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 no. Stay where you are. Did Landoa just go down? No, he's still up. I see shaking, that's all. It's Val. Still Val. That's another one. Come on, there we go. Why won't these guys leave? Just leave, you're going to lose. Oh, that's Landoa down. Get in there. Come on. I think that's all of them. Did you murder my husky? Ah, we got two left coming. Okay. Uh, Barexios. Oh, they decided to kidnap who they can and leave. Good luck with that. I don't think you'll get very far, honestly. But, good luck. That'll do it. Alright, undraft. Uh, Kai. Yeah, this is, this is a problem. Um, there should be a, a rescue order in there, right? Rescue Val. Rescue Landauer. I think that's all of them. And then these guys get finished off. And we'll figure out what we want to do after that in a moment. Oh, Delilah. Extreme oh, immunity. Uh, it's fine. We'll pick you up, though, at some point. Right now, we got bigger fish to fry. Stepan needs to get up. And come and deal with the injured. Extreme immunity on that one. Good. Dead in 7.9 hours. I hear some slashing. Good. Okay, get tending. Or eat your stew first. Whatever. As long as Val doesn't die, you're okay, I suppose. No, 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 no. Delilah's kind of in an awkward spot. Ah. Well... Rescue now. It's just got trivial malnutrition, but the uh, the infection that's downed her is actually already gone, which is good. Oh, yes, we've got a dying animal. A rescue. The miscarry's fine. We didn't really want extra. Um, Canto? Oh, boy. Oh, you're fine. No, no worries there. We'll let you go. If someone wants to pick you up, they can, but... Yeah. You're actually not injured anymore. You just passed out from the extreme infection, which has already become immune. So we might get slowed down, as we usually end up getting by uh, the raids. Hopefully not. It would suck if we had to uh, have many more episodes because we can't finish off this goddamn wall. We're so close, but yeah, we need to send out a trade to go get some gold for the bed. We need to floor all of these rooms. I'm not sure what I'm flooring with them. Oh, Mafioso died. That's fine. It's not a problem. It sucks, but we'll get over it. It's one less thing to uh, worry about. How's those pants coming along? They've been finished. Okay, so when Val's ready to come and pick them up, can uh, get over this unhappy nudity issue. Should be nice. 
I don't want to force him to do it because then I've got to go into the menu and sort it out and can't be asked. <laughs> All right. Almost there on the deconstruction of that wall. There we go. The rest of it's not going to take very long at all. The room's just going to look a little uneven is the only issue, but I'll get over it. How's our beer coming along? Fermented. Nice. For the most part. So we could use this beer to go buy the gold that we need for the bed. The royal bed. That would be nice. Lando are making cheese, I'm assuming. Oh. And so begins the frost murdering. We actually uh, lost a lot of this to the blight anyway, because apparently nobody went and chopped down all of these plants, but it's no big deal, really. They were going to die regardless. How much cloth did we manage to uh, get? 1,077. So we could actually fill in this bedroom with cloth. We want to have a royal bed in there as well. Let's make it a silver royal bed. How about that? And I'm just not going to put the quality builder on because it's going to take some very expensive resources and I'm probably going to be happy with whatever comes out from that. Uh, so if we're having a silver bed, what do we want the carpet to be? Maybe dark carpet. I don't quite know. We've got a lot of dark stuff in here already. Hmm. It might be cream. It'll mean that the royal bed will kind of merge with the colours, but the dark on the light might be okay. And we do have some colour in the room as well. Yeah, let's try cream carpet. Oh. We seem to have some mud in there. Okay. That's going to mean that I need some foundations, I think. Is it foundation base? Yeah. And then we put the platform over that, and then we can put carpet over it, I think, is how that works. We'll see. Damn, keep failing that one. Well, there is an excellent quality one over here we can always change over, but they're going to deconstruct that one anyway and we need an extra one, so it doesn't really make too much of a difference. As far as wood's concerned, it looks like we're actually uh, very light on that, so I might actually need a chop wood order. Start deforesting the planet <laughs> to make room. Got a little bit of uh, hops there. Uh, I guess we need like 20, I'm assuming. 25, yeah. So this is just going to go rotten, unfortunately. But it's not too much of a problem. The light carpet actually goes quite well with the rug, I suppose, as well. It's a nice light blue with white mufflers. So hopefully this area looks nice. I'm no artist. Don't get me wrong. Uh, <laughs> I just go with what looks right in my warped little mind. <laughs> Let's get that hauled urgently. Looks like a lot of the stuff's been moved around, but I'm guessing I haven't, yeah, I haven't ordered cremating corpses yet. So a lot of that is actually just waiting around. Just minor breaks, unfortunately. Everyone's health is probably fine at this point. I don't think anyone really had anything other than the um, infection to worry about, so that's okay. Got Rusty working on dismantling stuff by the looks of it. Very nice to see. You actually working on weapons on here? Oh, you get wood from it, I guess. Hmm. Let me chop this down. I don't need any of this. Get it gone. I just don't really want to order them to do it, because... It'll waste my time. Once uh, we've got 652 cloth left. I'm going to have enough for this then, by the looks of it, quite easily. I would imagine. We need some medieval cots in here, but as I mentioned in a previous episode, we actually... Wow, we've uh, mostly run out of 
hay grass already. That's actually problematic. Hmm. I might need to unrestrict all of my animals to like the home zone to make sure that they don't starve to death. I hoped that we would have a stockpile full of food here, but seems I was wrong. We're actually very much lacking. Oh boy. Hmm. I don't know where I want to put this revenge cat. Being wooden, it's just uh doesn't match my colour palette for the bedroom. If any of these become like a masterwork or anything like that, they're immediately going over here. Uh, one of you guys did mention as well that we could maybe have an armchair to fill this area. I suppose that's something we could do. Um, it'd have to be a blue chair, I guess. Have we got like a blue ostrich leather there's just far too many things here to possibly know what we've got. So I'm going to have to go to this one. It's like ostrich leather is like the bluest that we can have. But ostrich leather is pretty hard to come by. Alternatively, we could just have like a, a gold or a white chair, I suppose. As far as gold, we got Yorkie skin and gazelle leather. Yet again, kind of hard to come by. I suppose it'll be Muffalo Wool. A Muffalo Wool armchair. <laughs> I could stay to that. Okay. There's Muffalo Leather. What is Muffalo Wool? Or can you not make... Oh, there it is. Nice bright colour, actually. Let's go with that. Relaxing socially on your own. Yeah. Not questioning that at all. Alright, carpet. Cream carpet. Nope, definitely need the foundation base. Or is it platform? It's platform. Okay. Fill that in and then we can put the carpet in there. There's a lot of uh, heel root hanging around. We do have 46, but that's not much. I'm going to select similar because we went around uh, harvesting all of the uh, the heel root plants in the area. So if I set them to haul urgently, they'll go and grab them. Might be a little bit of a wasted time, but well, these poor quality. I thought I'd set. Maybe I didn't actually set the quality builder to. Uh... Ooh, legendary. That's pretty great. Caravan request. Bearded battle axe for some uranium. Nope. Not gonna happen. Hmm. And a party. Man who's throwing a party. Awesome. Bring the beers. We have plenty. Was that it? Was, was that the party? Well, that was underwhelming. <laughs> Look at the state of this place. Oh my god. I just can't disassemble things quick enough. We do need to uh, set ourselves up a trade then, I guess. Uh, let's go to the world. And let's send Brexios and Ape out to go trade. Uh, Brexios and Ape and two days worth of food. Oh, we haven't produced food today. That's annoying. Okay, uh, we'll give it a minute for our cook, Trobo, to make us some meals. Brexios is on it, apparently. And it's refueling. Well, we'll let you go do that. Because we need the meals, essentially, so... Can't really leave without them. I could do with people not eating raw food if you'd be so kind, Braxios. Do you actually do cooking? No, you don't. So it's now on Trobo to do that for us. Need in 
ingredients. Don't have the ingredients for a weak stew. Why do I find that hard to believe? How about that? Maybe I have to pause and pause. Oh, that's the refuel. I'm misreading it. Go! Get on with it. Make me some meals, and then Brexios and Ape can go trade for the gold, as well as maybe some meat or something like that. I'm a little worried that we're going to run out of food during winter. And I'm best setting off now, uh, before the snow settles, otherwise we'll be in a lot of trouble. It also allows me to clear the stockpiles so that we can deal with this issue, which is uh, clearly a large issue. <laughs> Oh dear. We've also got some corpses as well that need burning, so let's set that one up. Have we, uh... Oh, there we go. We've got some uh, stuff freezing off and dying. A hare has been self-tamed and slaughtered. Awesome. Alright. Uh, Brexios and Ape, you've got the food now. At least I'm pretty sure you have. There you are. Two days worth of food, and let's fill you up essentially. I'm gonna bring. I think I'm gonna bring the mufflers. Let's bring some mufflers, and then we can do a big trade because we're gonna need to, right? So much smoke leaf. Have I uh, paused the order? I think I might have. That gives us something to do during winter then, if there's no crafting tasks available. Let's get these puzzle boxes. All those human corpses. Uh, we'll grab the beer and a lot of the crappy weapons I guess we'll take with us. We actually have a bearded axe from that trade, but I just don't need the uranium, basically. So I'm not going to bother. Take all of that. Anything that's superior or excellent or anything like that I'm going to keep. Because I know we've got some people missing weapons right now. Uh, so I want to keep a few of those around. Put these in here. Let's take all of those. Take the lot. Some of it I'll just like keep. But I'll get rid of even if it does match what we need. Some fire bombs. I'll sell those. We've never actually needed those, so I'm actually just going to get rid of them. We've been holding them for, like, most of this run. Get rid of all of the dead man's clothing. Actually, just get rid of all the clothing, really. Sell it all. We do have, like, unhappy nudity, which is coming from the lack of pants. I swear we had a pair that Val could actually wear, but he's refusing to, I guess. I don't know. I'll uh, Once I've set up this trade, I'll actually just bump the priority up. I swear we had some striped trousers on the floor. Maybe I was wrong. No, there they are. They're right here. Val's just complaining for no reason. Alright. Keep it going. And this is why we're bringing the mufflers. I think that's it. Yeah, we can bring some socks. And anything else? Some smoke leaf joints. Bring those. Yep, that loop. Oh, I need to hang on. I'm gonna go here. It takes two point eight days, so I actually need six days worth of food. Oops. Don't tell me I have to do it again. Uh, we'll do it again at uh, a later date. Bloody misclicks. Alright, we're going to leave it off here anyway, guys. I do hope you've all enjoyed. If you have, then be sure to like and subscribe and hit that little bell icon. All that jazz, and I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.